Hey guys, how's it going? Have you having a wonderful day now? Now I'm hard on. Mm, Alright, not bad that thing today. Oh dear lord. You're saying they have a copyrighted bloody music track in Fortnite called Flip Reset? Flip Reset's bloody copyrighted? Why bother making a lobby track if it's copyrighted? Well guys, in case you're wondering what lobby track I was listening to, it was this. Now guys, you might be wondering, why are you wearing... Now also, so much has happened, this island is not what it once was. Now guys, um, yeah, I played the um, game mode last night to get some more um, stuff for the Rocket League. So yeah, I thought, you know what, I'll add it. I don't know if we've got a loading screen for it, but I don't think we do. And also guys, just when I did get on just a moment ago, I also got the things that I should have actually got yesterday. Now, um, where is it? If I just find it... Oh, there's Omnisword. There it is. So guys, as you can see from the things, when you get to the last one, you'll get these colours. But then you can also get these things. And they look kind of cool. Wait, why did I not just favour that? What is wrong with me? Oh, well, guys, you may notice I do have more V-Bucks than I did yesterday. That's because I was just in a game and I got a little 1,000 V-Bucks card. It was weird of having a silent lobby. Hold on. And this time around, we're going to be getting the pickaxe. So I can stop using the 24 karat... 24 karat katana. Let's see what we've got here. Eldid's locker bundle. Okay. Ah, uh, Lil Octane. Another thing about it, I should... I guess 500 V-Bucks couldn't hurt. You know what? Yeah. Don't worry about why I have that, um, guy's thing equipped. Wait, so you're saying the lobby track is copyrighted, but that's not. Makes sense. Guys, don't worry about why I had that guy's, uh, code in there. It's put simply, because I was playing a game mode, and well, to get a free gold pump, you'd have to put in his code. So, yeah, I did that. I think this is, no, okay. I need to favor some of my emotes. But I'll do that another time. Hold on, one of my Xbox friends just got on. Well, is it gave me a notification? Either way. Let's just. Uh, by the way, guys, the big battle thing came out quite late last night. Right, Not too long after I um completed the. um What's it called? The Rocket League quest. Like, as you can see, I didn't complete all of them, but I completed most of them. So let's see where we got to go. Now guys, let me actually show you what Big Battle is like. Actually no, firstly I'll do these quests in um, Team Rumble, show you what Big Battle is like. So firstly, let's find um, Team Rumble. One friend playing. Bullshit. That guy's the headset cut out again. Wait a minute, so 392, so I'll pretty much be reaching level 400 today. I can't pickaxe. See, first we've got to go up to this place here. So, what's the chrome quest gonna be? 
Lavender. Is this going to be Chrome locations or something? Or do I have to be Chromed for them or something like that? Now guys, I know I could just do this in a um, a normal game, but I really don't want to do it in a normal game. Because I, I know that I'll just get lasered immediately. This thing is taking too long to find a match. If I have to, I'll go into a normal match, I'll grab the thing, then I'll literally head into a different match straight after. Let's, if it hits 30 seconds and it hasn't found a match, guys, I'll just go into a normal solo match to grab it. I'm wondering what I'm going to choose to use that Photonic Striker pickaxe on. Because I want to use it on one of my combos, at least. I actually might use it for um, my Agent Jones combo. Like, well, my, as I call it, default combo. But for now, time to unlock the pickaxe. And guys, I've also tidied up my room a little bit more, so it looks a bit more tidy. Which I really do enjoy, like, I swear to God, like, I don't understand what it is, but it's like, whenever you clean your room, and you see how much space it is, it looks so much better, but then after a day or two, it's like, meh, this is just my room. It's not just drank over, it's much going on your right, and it'll start to heal itself. Okay. Even, I just hope that the enemy line doesn't have the landmark token thing on it. But even if it does, I don't care. Thank god we've got it. Did someone just try to snipe me? Either way, let's go grab it. Now guys, Big Belt is kind of annoying though, because... Put simply... Oh my god, what the hell, my FPS just dropped. Yeah, put simply, the um... Like, you will see all your teammates' markers showing up, no matter what, and it is massively annoying. Like, because then millions of people are just spamming the markers constantly. It's like, oh my god, just stop it. I love how more than half these people are probably going for the level of path token. Nice. I only care about doing these quests, so ya yeet! And then we'll just go straight back down to get some more distance. Let me cancel the marker, please. There we go. Can't wait to see what this pickaxe is like. I mean, it's probably gonna be like one of those pickaxes that's dual, like, but held by both hands instead of just one hand. Shifty Shack. I might try and play this game out, guys, but I don't think I'm going to bother this time around. I just want to show you it so I can at least let's show you where the um, level up tokens are, and then after that, boom. That was a teammate. Foam Crossroads. I can manage that. It's on top of the balloon. Hey, kid! <laughs> Hi! Thanks for the little lift. This guy's definitely doing his level of pack token as well, because I'm pretty sure that guy's been to the three locations I've been. Now, guys, these only came out like half an hour ago, I think. Something like that. Oh, no. I can manage this. Four in a game, like Jesus Christ, this is just easy. I can't wait to see what the chrome one is. It should just say like not collect level up token, but like at least say it's no way someone in storm. Ah well, he can stay in storm, I don't care. Honestly, just as long as he doesn't cause me any harm, I don't care. But if he decides to shoot at me, you can fuck right off. Because, mate, I have just chosen not to attack you. So if you choose to attack me, that is so rude. Because I am choosing not to attack you right now. So if you attack me, you're just not right. Did that guy just die or something? Because, literally, I saw my teammates thing and suddenly it disappeared. Oh, it's right next to a launcher. Got yeet! <laughs> I love how the next one is literally right on top of some pills already. Oh 
What's up, kid? Uh, sorry, I don't mean to do this. Hey, I wasn't gonna attack you, mate. Oh, wait, now you've got your teammate with you. Oh, you fucker. You actual fuck. Ah, oh, well, this next one's in Jesus Christ, they all seem to be in zone right now. Which I respect. Let's just get over there. Um, where's the balloon? I'm gonna go to this balloon so I can get some quick height, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna have tank storm, but I don't care. Like, that guy's probably like, why was this guy challenging me if he didn't have anything to live off of? Mate, that was the point. I didn't even care. Honestly, I don't care about winning this game. I just want to show people where the quest things are. And after that, I don't give a shit. This guy's probably coming to do his quest as well. Alright, let's head over to the reality tree. Let me just mark it again. It's literally where all my teammates are. This island is not what it once was. So true. In the past, it was so calm. No need for sprayers and all. And now look at it. Sprayers are literally everywhere. You literally cannot escape them. Like, you literally have no ability. It's You spray or you bloody die now. Please tell me no enemy players are here, but even if there was, they would be screwed. Maybe not. Come on, fight me! You're weird! What's the bet he's gonna camp the ground? Anything, he camps the ground. Just put me closer to it, Fortnite! I don't wanna have to glide from right next to Tilted all the way over there! What the hell? Is it that hard just to put me next to a location? Oh my god, Fortnite. It's not that hard. Just put... There we go. Set back up. These guys are just going to be camping the location, aren't they? Oh, hello. 24 shield. Come on, you wuss. What is wrong with you? Did you just disconnect? Hurt, low octane. Oh, someone's not camping that box. You're camping a box. Who uses a ranger shotgun? You weirdo! Like, you're so weird. Who even uses the ranger shotgun? Basically, no one likes it. Loads of people hate it. It's like the bloody auto shotgun. No one liked that thing. Literally, every YouTuber hates it. I mean, mate, if I wasn't trying to do my level up quest pack things, I would be destroying pretty much more than half of you by now. But no, I'm more dedicated to leveling up. So you lot, if you think- Oh, fuck off. You did not just try and shoot me from the sky. Cringe warriors. Stop it. Oh, fuck off. You missed that shot. You are- You are so cringe. You are actual cringe. I could've shot you a million times round, kid. I could've shot you whenever I wanted. So be grateful I didn't. If he danced on me, I'd be like, kid, don't even act like he could. But trust me, guys, I had the ability to shoot him so many times. I could just turn around and killed him. But no, I chose not to shoot him because I was willing to be friendly because I just want to get these level up tokens. But yet, these guys are just being annoying little freaks. I swear, this guy's in the storm. I'm gonna be mad. Where's the last one? Right nearby. They're all very close by, so if you manage to get a good zone, you fuck off! If these kids chase me down, I swear to fucking god, I'm gonna be fucking. There's no way this kid's chasing me, right? There we go. And I got the pickaxe. Now, okay, let's just get away from here. And let's just leave the match. Oh my fucking god! You loser! You actual loser! Why is it with so many losers in Team Rumble? Like, they're always like, Oh, look, someone's in the sky. Let's shoot them. 
because they have no defense whatsoever. And we know that if they get the chance, we're going to lose. Like, that's what people do in there. They constantly shoot you on the sky. It's like, oh, look at this kid. He's in the sky. Seriously, go get a life, you weirdos. You have no skill. Like, if I wanted to, I could have chosen to actually get weapons to fight you with. But no. And anyway, who uses the Razor Shotgun? Like, seriously, I'm sorry. Like, I know yesterday I said that, like, honestly, if you like it, I don't have a problem with it. But I'm sorry, but anyone that uses it, I find you quite weird, to be fair. Because I don't like that thing. I hate it. I bloody hate the shotgun. I don't like it at all. It's my least favorite shotgun. And honestly, if anyone says, dude, it's my favorite shotgun because it's literally the best shotgun in the game, then I'm sorry, but something's not right with you. I'm not saying anything against you, but honestly, maybe I am at this point. Either way, let me show you a big battle for now, guys. But seriously, I'm sorry for getting annoyed, guys. But seriously, what is it with so many weirdos in Team Rumble? It's just like, oh, look at this guy. He's in the sky. Let's shoot him out of it. I get a life, you weirdos. You're not good. Wait, do I have the reactive state of... Oh, okay, I think I might have broken the system now. I was wanting to check if I had the reactive style of my backbling on, but seriously, like, if those kids that kill me had done, like, uh, done any emo on me, I'd be like, kid, I could have killed you whenever. Because literally, like, that kid with the range shotgun, I could have attempted to actually kill him, but I didn't want to bother. Like, honestly, if I was actually trying to, I would have bothered tr attempting to kill him, but no, I didn't want to bother, because it would be a waste of my time. And also, the other kid that I knew was behind me, I could have shot him so many times, but I didn't bother. Because I wanted to get the level up token. So if they had danced me, I'd be like, kid, just know that if I wanted to, I would turn around and bloody beam the hell out of you. Because I had the ability to do that so many times. Oh, this thing actually has a lot more people in it this time around. But guys, this is, um, a big battle. I can't see the timer. Five people. Huh. Last night there was basically no one playing it. But guys, uh, you'll see what loadout I start with. Look, tank the bus driver. Yeah, guys, this is what's the annoying part. People just can constantly do that, and it is so annoying. Jesus Christ, stop it! I'm gonna drop Flutterbarn. The moment I can jump, I'm jumping. Jesus Christ! See, guys, this is so, the annoying part of it. You have to deal with your team spamming the living crap out of that stuff. No chest in there. And also, guys, don't worry, you've got Glyra here, boy. Now, the loot you can find is either rare or better. And as you guys can see, you get this loot that I've got. Give me something good. With that. Move out of my way, kid! Why was someone just using an RPG? I don't anyone else is here, and if they are, they're weird. Guys! Seriously! You don't need to mark everything in sight! It's not that big of a deal, for crying out loud! Oh! Drives me insane, guys. Like, I'm sorry. Like, it's just so annoying. Like, you cannot say that this is not super annoying. Just having to put up with this constantly. Oh god, the other team is starting to get the better hand of things. Quit it! With the markers! The other team is always starting to get the upper hand, but that's because like it's probably just like certain people on their own. For now. Oh my god, the good old combat SMG. Oh my god, there's probably no danger there, so don't marker it if it's not got danger. There's probably no danger there. Huh, you can get keys in here? I actually, I actually didn't know you could get keys in here, to be fair. 
Oh my god, if these guys continue marking stuff, I'm actually gonna start losing my sanity. And no joke, guys, I'm already losing my sanity here. Like, honestly, yeah, those guys that died were just on their own, that's for sure. Will you stop it? Oh, that guy's so far away. Mate, no one's near you, so don't bother danger marking if no one's near you! I forget you're in danger, but if we're not close enough, then what do you expect us to do? Also, guys, it is zero build, as you can see. I was forgetting about that. Oh! Come on, you. You need a headset, G. How's that guy not already dead? We get it, kid! Oh my god, stop danger marking I'm going to lose it. Always time to lose of it. Can you stop doing that? We get there. We get it. Dead over there, but honestly, not gonna be pushing them because the teammates are just gonna be hiding. You're not getting him back up. And these guys start moving like normal people. I guess they're not normal, so what can I say? Whoever just tries to snipe me. Oh, hello! You got trash aim! And someone with usual trash aim, I would know. Jesus Christ, what did you get your shot? Where are my bullets going now? Someone's in the bush. Weirdo! You're getting far, kid. You weirdo! Why would you take that fight? You were going to lose it. Count yourself lucky your teammate's here! Oh, count yourself lucky your teammate came along to save you, you noob! You actually suck at this game! You are not skilled! You actually need your teammate's help! Oh, that is so sad! Imagine needing your teammate's help! Imagine... Because guys, you can't deny, if it wasn't for his teammate, he was dead! Like, that guy would have died if it wasn't for his teammate! So, so mate, count yourself lucky your teammate showed up to save your life! Oh my god, my teammates are just run straight into everywhere that is gonna get them killed. Like, honestly, mate, if you even think you're skilled, you literally need your teammates' help just to let you know. So you're that bad at the game. So don't think of yourself as good, because trust me, you're not. You're trash. Like, literally. No joke, guys, because look, you saw that. He literally required his teammates' help. If it wasn't for his teammate, he was dead. And, and anyway, I also got weakened earlier. So seriously, you can't say much. If these guys, so if these guys think they're good, I'm sorry, but mate, if it wasn't for your teammate, we'd have killed you straight away.
So count yourself lucky. Literally, count yourself lucky. Count yourself lucky that you're all just camping locations because you're that bad. Okay, why are you bothering to take sniper shots into a... Why would you look straight at the monster? Mate, use your bloody AR. Are you that dumb? <laughs> this guy needs brain cells. Oh, great. Most of them are now dead. But they it's probably because they need their teammates' help. Like, it doesn't mean they're a better team than us. Because, guys, trust me, you can't say they're actually worth good, that They're actually good. I mean, honestly, what level even is this guy? Honestly, I'm clear. One more guy left. He doesn't talk to me. Don't you even think of doing a toxic game? If you do a toxic game, I swear to God. Good on you, because if you did a toxic game, I would hunt you, I would add you, and then just at, tell you to 1v1 me in that game mode, and then I would literally clap you. Because literally, you can't deny, guys, he lit that guy near his teammate's assistance. Because did you see how low I got that um Christmas skin? Like, that Christmas skin was one hit from anything, even a pickaxe. So if it wasn't for the teammate, he was dead. So, mate, can't yourself lucky your teammate came along to save your bloody life? Because otherwise, you would have died. And guys, if any of you are saying, mate, stop complaining, trust me, that guy was going to kill you one way or another. Guys, he wasn't going to kill me if it wasn't for his teammate. So he was lucky his teammate came along to assist him. Because guys, you saw how fast I, I was destroying him. So mate, like if he did a toxic emote, like if he did laugh me off or something, I'd be like, kid, try fight me on your own here with just only the starter loot and I will literally body you. Because guys, I'm not joking, I will body him instantly. Like he needed his teammate's assistance. Like if you need your teammate's assistance, I'm sorry, go get fucked. But yeah, I'm gonna play a few rounds of this just to show you guys what it's like. I'm sorry that I'm starting to be a uh, way too angry. I'm to constantly repeat myself in an angry fit of it and all. But guys, I'm sorry. I can't help you, okay? I think I act like this thing's very new. I mean, it is kind of new, but I mean, what the hell is that combo? That is a disgusting combo. Get the hell away from me, Batman! That is the worst combo I've seen in a hot minute. Like, I'm sorry, I've seen some bad combos, but that Batman skin, oh, that is a horrible combo. The reality tree is on, oh wait, why was I saying the reality tree is on Spawn 9? It's all here. Well, it's been here for a while. Watch as loads appeal marker location. Huh. Let's see how many teammates we've got. So, eight people on our team. I'm just going to draw Cloudy Condors. Dear Lord, like this is the most annoying part of it guys, like besides, like if it wasn't for it being able to show you all the markers, then fine, it would be nice to play, but with the fact that you have to see so many markers, okay that's just a Ranger AR, so hell no to that. But seriously guys, if you say like, dude, he will kill you even if it wasn't for his teammate, guys, he wasn't going to. I can assure you of that. Like, he literally required his teammate to assist him. I mean, and I didn't even require my teammates to assist me in any of those fights. Because I mean, I literally lasered most of them with m just my own skill. Skill that I have, which they apparently don't. Oh, time to annoy people. Sometimes my annoying side does break through, which is also pretty much my toxic side, guys. And my toxic side and my angry side are the same sides. And trust me, if you make it show itself... Oh, mm, which one to choose? Uh, there. Hey, we get it. There's meds everywhere. And guys, as you can see, yes. Well, okay, that's uh, someone's weapon that they dropped. Uh, purple hammer AR on the ground. Do you think that in the past you could actually find, like, purple and legendary loot on the ground? 
but now you can't. Like you have to find those items through chests. No joke, guys. In case you don't know, like at the start of the you actually could find that loot on the ground itself, a like purple and legendary loot. But they removed that. Don't know why. I guess it was just too overpowered being able to hopefully spot a legendary item on the ground straight away when you landed. Also, this is the pickaxe. For this skip. Kind of cool if you ask me. I might use it a bit more. But I will swap to my main combo that I like to use, of course, guys. Why am I glad I'm not reading for like I wanted it to? Huh, okay. The team is still kind of on even circumstances for now. I mean, you guys are probably like, mate, your team has uh, less than uh, like less teammates currently than they do. So what? It's not like it's full on strength in numbers. Well, I mean, technically it is, I guess. But I mean, you know what I mean, guys. That guy really just pushed our whole team on his own. You psycho. I didn't even know my combat energy was legendary. I thought it was purple. They just die normally or Nope. Oh beneath me. Fuck off. I know I need my teammate to save me that time, but honestly, that's understandable. I want to see, like, I kind of am lagging right now when you think about it. I shouldn't have used that for H shield. That guy had a prime shotgun, didn't he? Oh no, he just had two shot. But I can hear a prime shotgun. Is someone literally right over here? Where do you think you're going? Don't go get far, mate. Bum rush him. He's hiding up here, I swear to God. Oh no, he's already not. Yeah, heavy sniper. Yoink. Probably not going to hit a sniper shot, but might as well try because I mean, so the last thing I'm going to hit is an RPG. Like, I'll probably have a better chance of hitting a sniper than an RPG. That actually hit my foot. You're going to get killed, mate. Your teammate. Wait, aim kid. I need to find that shotgun because this two shot shotgun just ain't gonna cut it. Like it's gonna cut it for a while, but it can't cut it for long. I think some people are leaving the game to be fair, because they know it's all over. Oh no, never mind, we've got to find one more person. And now I find Prime Shot in the city when there's one guy left. Haha, <laughs> he literally left the game! Like honestly, these quest, these matches go way too fast. Like they need to make it so like there's a way to make it go slower. Cause this big bell thing, like literally, it's over in like three minutes. Well, five minutes or so. But you get what I mean. Like it's over way too fast. Like you're and like honestly, like, I mean, I can understand like normal team rumble. Like you could literally 
like by that time like I guess it's like because you're trying to get to a certain amount of points like they should make it so it's this that type uh, you know what hold on now I'm trying to choose but I do want to keep this on but I want to use the new crew pickaxe so I can see what it's like let's take a look at it for now if I don't like it I won't use it but if I like it I'm keeping it for now, and it will stay as my main pickaxe for this skin. So, guys, I might be changing my main combo up a bit. We'll see if I like this pickaxe or not. So when we go in game, I'll give it a few swings, see how it sounds and all that. See how it sounds when it hits materials and everything. And if I like it, I will keep it. But otherwise, no. I don't know why it didn't give it to me yesterday. I guess it must have just been buggy during yesterday. But anyway guys, like nowadays as well with those V-Bucks thing, I'm now going to be, like every three weeks I should be able to get like 6,000 V-Bucks because there's a 5,000 V-Bucks thing at the game store for um, uh, this stuff. Hmm. Okay, it sounds kind of silent. Let's see how it sounds when it hits the thing. Basically not even making a noise. I kind of like that, actually, to be fair. Like, with it not making a noise. Oh, no. The one SMG that everyone in the game hated. The charge. Like, don't get me wrong. You can absolutely do this to people. But honestly, the charge sucked. Like, no one liked it, really. I mean, quite a few people liked it, but... More than half the people hated it. Like, no joke, guys. If someone says, dude, no, everyone loved that SMG. Guys, basically no one used it. Like, inform me, not long after it came out, how many of you do you see used now? Like, everyone loved the combat SMG. The combat SMG was 10 times better than that one. Ever will be. Whatever has been, whatever will be. And guys, yeah, I'm gonna, I might keep Champion, sh Champion Sales Shark. You know what, I'll just call it CSS. CSS is a company now that I that, right? Like, yeah, well, I'll keep this glider on from now on. Because honestly, I'm actually starting to like this guy a lot more. On my SMG. The better SMG over the SMG that should not have been removed. What the hell? Oh. Um, you know what? Let's grab the combat AR. It's actually quite powerful. I didn't really like the combat pistol much. Back then, I wasn't really using pistols at all. Because, I mean, back then, who would choose to use a pistol? Like, no one would. No one does nowadays. Like, literally, no one wants pistols because no one cares about pistols. But they don't realize their true strength. That's why they don't use them. Like, the pistol actually puts a massive beam in. Even the old pistol, like, if it was on purple or legendary, oh, those things could beam. I can assure you, when I was playing the Spider-Man vs. Spider-Man and Crave Gamer, there was a legendary pistol you could get from one of the machines, and guys, huh, well, I guess I'm about to show you why it was actually quite overpowered. Especially if, like, if Zero Building was around back then, I can assure you that literally, this thing would be the one thing that could delete people. We get it, kid. Hold on. Oh, hello! Someone's here. I'm gonna ignore it for now. Let me through this wall! He's right on him, I think. Careful, just make sure we don't get headshot. I was just about to loot that, but alright. I know I could give him my two big pots, but then I won't have heals for myself. Oh, uh, where did he go? Ah oh, well. Where you come from, where you go, where you come from, Cotton Eye Joe. If I'm been for Cotton Eye Joe, I've been mad a long time ago. Where you come from, where you go, where you come from, Cotton Eye Joe! Jesus Christ, they just blocked my slide. People are over here. Let's go. Whoa. 
a llama, but I don't care. I need to go help out the team. Yay. What's this? Oh my god. Um, I don't feel good about this. Yeah, their whole team is here, so if one of us gets in the way of it, it's going to be a whole team beaming us down. Okay, yeah, I don't think we're living, so I might need to literally just yeet out of here. I'm sorry, but I have to leave my teammates at this point. I'm going to die otherwise. I'm literally going to get ruined if I stay there. Sorry! But guys, I'm taking... Like, honestly, it's a worthy sacrifice right now. Like, honestly, don't worry. They'll come towards us anyway. So we still have the time we need. Like, their whole team is down there, guys. Like, literally, pretty... Well, pretty much the whole team. Are you hiding, you little loser with a sniper? Oh, you're hiding in the bush, aren't you? I bet you anything he's hiding in that bush. But he's a wuss. Yeah, he's hiding in the bush. That's what he's doing. He's hiding there. He's scared. Yeah, look at him. He's hiding. They're just all hiding there because they're scared. You guys need to come to zone, you know. Weirdos. Why would you land on us? Guys, if you tap fire this weapon, it's actually got a good clue. Knocked someone out. Guys, I've got heals to last. And anyway, you need to come to us. So why are you still... Why would you... Why are they still sitting over there? You guys need to come to us. Like, we've got the advantage. We have zone. They don't. I don't know why they're still sitting over there. Let's get after this kid. down. Better not pick up even dance on us. Because mate, you literally need your whole team's assistance here. And honestly, like and anyway, whoever was using that RPG, go get a life. Like look at them, it's literally the whole team right now. So I mean I can understand this since it's a teamwork game mode. I guess better not put off anything toxic. Because if you did, go screw yourself. Oh, need ammo. He's got no sniper ammo. Mate, I don't think they give a damn about you. Yeah? Alright. Just don't get drunk this time. Alright. One teammate, I swear down, my teammate clutches this up. That is just gonna be insane. Imagine my one teammate actually just 1v 27s them. I'd be like, bruh. Imagine being 1v 27. Literally, they need their whole team pushing right now. How can they not find him? This guy finds really well. He's quite good at hiding. I will give him that much. I think I just saw him though. He's, I think he's on the edge of the storm. And that's what I was seeing. Oh, 
Oh, stop acting like a sweat, kid. Stop acting like a sweat. You really had your teammates assist you. Don't act like you were so busy. Oh, mate, you can't build here, you idiot. So stop and stop acting like you're a sweat, kid. You, you had your whole team with you. If you were a sweat, you would have been just killing me on your own. But no, you didn't. You had your whole team with you. So don't act like you're a sweat, kid, because you're not. I mean, maybe he is, I don't know. But I doubt he is a sweat. I can't see, mate. Because, guys, in case you don't know, what he was doing, swapping backwards and forwards from his weapons when he saw that someone was spectating him, that's pretty much like what stupid your sweats do. It's so annoying, like, why do you have to act like you're a sweat when, more than half time, you're not a sweat? Also, guys, let me show you an easy way to do a certain quest for gaining points in the Rocket League Live thing. Um, now, guys, you have to go into this one specifically, because this one actually doesn't count for it. This one does. And if we go into here, <laughs> I can show you which one you specifically have to be in for it. Now, guys, I actually do have some sweets in my bag behind me, so I'm just going to grab them real quick. Burgers are sweet, by the way, guys. That'd be bigger than what they look like. Now, guys, let me show you the best one to go for to get the points in. But simply, now, the way to get some... Who? of these specific game modes. Now guys, I would recommend going to race track, because freestyle, you have to go through some hoops, and some of them are quite challenging to go through. But race track, that's what it is. It's a race track. And you just go around the track. Come on, Pyro. Now guys, as you can see, you get 5 points for every ring. I'm close to one it was 10 points. But look at my points on the top right corner. Oh no, yeah, it's 5 points. I think so. Yeah, 5 points for every ring. But check how many the um, last one gives you. Because guys, freestyle is kind of annoying to do. Now guys, if you go through here, you get 20 points. Now guys, when you do finish the track, do not go to the left hand side one. Because otherwise it will exit you from the track, but I mean you can just go back into it. But yeah guys, I would recommend you do this one because it is very fast for getting the points in. And oh, it is a challenge, I can assure you. And then of course you really know how to work the cars. And also for the Octane Race one guys, if you want to do the one where you have to, um, you know, um, do it in 2 minutes 3 seconds. Put simply, all I'm going to assure you is, to do that, you really need to get a perfect round. Like, and I mean a perfect round. If you mess up one, you literally don't get two minutes straight. Oh, what the hell did I just do? Careful, mate. You don't want to flip your car. What's that guy doing? Jeez. Learn to drive, boy. 
I really enjoy the part of our raid, if I'm being honest, because the... Oh my god, that was kind of clean. <laughs> but then I messed it up. That was kind of clean with how I recovered, but then messed it up. So fast. Now guys, as you do know, yes, I've done all the quests, so I don't care about doing this. But still, who's to say I can't bother doing it again? Now guys, I'll see if I can show you what Octane Race is like. So like I can show you an easy way to hopefully get it done as fast as you can. Now the Snipers one, don't worry guys, just attack the cars as much as possible and then do what you have to. Because the quest for that one is easy. Now Rocketeer Ruins, you just gotta find coins and you've also gotta go into these things called hard points. They'll show up on your map constantly with giant beacons, so don't worry about that one, that one's kind of easy. But I'll show you what you do in the Octane race right now. So let me return to the lobby and I'll show you what you do in Octane race. Let me just get another bit of love hearts into me. I actually like the love hearts sweets because like they're nice and fizzy. If this wrapping can come off of it please. Now guys, uh, like, don't worry. Now, um, guys, I'm only going to show you what you're doing. Actually, let me see if I can get into a private one now that I think about it. But then again, I don't think it would work properly, would it? I guess there's only one way to find out. Let's see if we can get it in private. And if so, we, I can show you the best way to complete the trap without any interruptions from others. Now guys, don't get me wrong, I don't mind having some interruptions from others, but I would at least like to show you the trap itself without having to have people intrude upon it but if they have to i'll have people intrude i don't care but honestly yeah guys i'll show you what you can do for this part sound of plastic annoys you guys by the way i don't mean to make it annoying here oh you didn't know you could now do that Alright now guys, of course, you're going to have to want to go for car number one. Or at least some of the ones that are in the front. And guys, if you want to show your race to do something, try doing this. Just slightly use up your boost every now and again. Let's get ready to go. Now guys, firstly you go across here, then you just boost upwards and look upwards a bit. And if you hold it down long enough, you get an extra boost of speed. Then you do the same here. Now guys, try not to touch the... Now try and get through those rings if you can. Now for this part guys, you just simply boost and you go straight through a hole. Never mind. I swear down you can't... But guys, no joke, you can't actually boost through that by the way. Oh great. Uh, guys, I am messing up here but honestly the glass I was a lot better I can assure you. But guys, for this one you just got a boost. I can assure you of that much. Because look, you just boost, boom! And then you just keep boosting along here, do this. And guys, when you get to this wall, you might want to try and speed up a bit, because after all, it's quite a flat surface, so just use up your boost here. And then hopefully you don't mess up like that. Now guys, I did manage to just about do it luckily enough. Now guys, for this, once again, boost. And also, if you can, go through that ring. Whee! Now guys, you don't have to boost in the air like I just did. Now guys, for this one, be prepared for it. Because if you want to, you can just attempt to go through the air. But that's a lot more of a challenge. So guys, if you don't manage to get through here straight away, don't worry. Just do this, lean upwards, boom. And then you do that. And then for this, you're going to have to do this. Okay, and hold on. Oh, that was actually smoother than last night, that was for sure. Now guys, I'm only showing you how to do it through the quickest time. And then guys, for this, you can just, uh, well, put simply go across it. And then when you get to here, guys, just literally boost with her hell. Because guys, it's just a flat wall there. Oh my god, I actually did not even try and go for that. 
Now that is for this. Fly if you can. And guys, if we come over here, you'll see this wall here. You just go straight up. Unless, of course, you fuck it up like I do. Wait, I'm fucking up the map. This is not what I'm wanting! Wait, actually, never mind. Now, guys, like, mortal things can happen when you're doing that. Now, guys, for this, I would just recommend just accelerate off of it. And then, hopefully, you don't run like that. And then, boom, you're just right here. And now, guys, as long as you don't mess up like I did a million times round just now, well, you can get that done quite easily. A small bag of Harry Boss Star Mix now, and then two Big Burger. Sweet. And then it'll be time to do some Save the World for a bit. And guys, no, I'm not going to bother trying to do those endurance missions, Beth. I can't be bothered. I have found someone to save the world. I might just go play some um, big battle or something. Or I might try and find a map where I can actually level up faster. Actually, what am I talking about? I'm going to reach level 400 whilst I'm in here. But yeah, because after I'm finished and save the world, I'll, um, I'll go play some stuff. But I'm going to do it off thing that way, guys, of course. Oh, that was the fast connection time than usual. It's a slower connection time than usual, just as connecting, but it's taking fucking forever. Oh no, you can have you can connect, please. Now guys, tomorrow when the week quests come out, I will do them, of course. Because why not? Even though I don't need to, but still, like I said, why not? Hmm. Plankerton. I'm obviously not going to do this quest, guys, because why should I? I mean, yes, I know I like to get XP as much as I can, but guys, I don't like XP that much. To go and do an endurance mission and suffer for like two to three hours of some hell. Anyway, I'm quite limited on resources right now. Maybe in the future I might. Like I might just decide to build some more stuff. But until then, no. Let me just show you the missions I'll be doing today in Save the World before I just, you know, hop off of the stream. So, um, firstly, let's just get these two out of my thing. Put these into here. Do that. Now, guys, you might be thinking, why don't you keep the wood and the um, metal as well? You guys, why would I? Let's then recycle these spare survivors. And also I'll check what farmers there are today and see if there's anything new in the event store first. Uh Am I gonna get superpowers? No. 
<laughs> I love how he's just like, am I getting a superpower that I'm like, no. Let me select her. Thank you, Fortnite. Oh, what's it? Wait, what's this pickaxe's description? Be a force of nature. All right, so now I know that one of them is going to be in Hexylvania. Wait, what's the date today? Sixteenth. So we've got four more days for this venture zone, by the way, guys. So if you want to get these levels in, you need to get them in now. So guys, I'm going to be doing this mission just to get this guy, and then if I just go over to um, here, can load, please. Thank you. I'll go to. Twin Peaks, and there's one mission that I'm going to have to be doing. Uh, Fortnite, come on, keep up, please. Uh, um, pardon me. This mission right here. Firestorm and all that. Alright, sure. I really can't wait to get my pain train to level 144, because it's so annoying knowing that, like, if I go into any, like, 140 zone that, or 4 player zone, like, uh, that's over level 100, I'm. Well, any level 100 zone that's a 4 player zone, like, the husks are going to be way more powerful than what my pain train is. Because my pain train won't be able to affect them much. Like, it'll still affect the fire husks, but it won't have enough effect against them. So, yeah, I need to upgrade. Alright! Sure. Alright. See ya. Guys, and speaking of which, I'm free to hop off the stream if my hero low can swap, please. Fortnite, what have you done to save the world right now? Like, seriously, you have literally not bothered. Like, now they just don't even seem to care about people on the old generation of consoles, which, Fortnite, you should start caring about us still. Like, Fortnite, just because we're on the older generation of consoles doesn't mean we don't that doesn't mean we need to have a glitchy game. Either way, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next stream.